What if the most powerful open source AI model right now wasn't from OpenAI or Meta or Google, but Alibaba? Yeah, Alibaba, the same company that runs half of China's internet economy just dropped a model that can reason in multiple language, solve code challenges, and even toggle its own internal thinking mode. And the wildest part, it's free. Open Weights, Apache 2.0 licensed, and already getting traction across dev communities. Hey, I'm Zach, and this is Patch Notes. Today, we're unpacking Quinn 3, what it is, how it works, and why it might be the smartest open model you're not using yet. Quick shout out to the team behind the shoot video deck. They're the folks who wrote, shot, and produced this whole thing. If your company's trying to explain anything remotely complex or create stunning product demos, hit them up at videodeck.co. So here's the story. We've covered Quinn 2.5 already, but in April 2025, Alibaba released Quinn 3, a new generation of open source large language models. Quinn 3 refers to a suite of large language models with different parameter sizes designed by Alibaba to scale across a wide range of devices and use cases. These new models are built on a transformer decoder architecture trained for general purpose tasks like text generation, translation, coding, reasoning, and multi-turn conversations. Quinn 3 was built with scale and versatility in mind. It includes compact models that work well on local machines and mobile hardware, all the way up to a 235 billion parameter mixture of experts version tuned for heavy duty interference in the cloud. It's designed to tackle complex language tasks across multiple language, perform well on coding and reasoning challenges, and handle extremely long context inputs. That range makes it generally useful across any unusually broad set of real world scenarios. That means you get the performance of a giant model with only a fraction of the compute. So you're not burning through eight H100s to get decent outputs. This is fine. And this isn't just a research preview or some academic release. Alibaba actually open sourced the entire lineup. Every wait file, license, and inference script is available. That's rare, and it matters. But let's talk about what makes this model different. Quinn 3 has a feature called thinking mode. It's exactly what it sounds like. You can tell the model to stop, reason, and think before answering. Want a fast response? Use the non-thinking mode. Want a slower, smarter breakdown? Turn on thinking mode. The model will internally chain its thoughts, almost like writing out scratch work, before responding. It's a weirdly simple concept, but incredibly powerful. It makes Quinn 3 better at multi-step math, logic, problems, and structured reasoning. And as a dev, you can literally toggle this behavior with a flag in the API. It's not some hidden thing, it's built right in. Architecturally, Quinn 3 is no slouch. The models are decoder-only transformers, trained on over 36 trillion tokens. That's a massive data set covering text, code, math, and multilingual sources, like over 100 different languages. They even generated their own synthetic data to help boost performance on STEM tasks. Oh, and it has a 128,000 token context window. That means you can shove an entire code base into the prompt or a 50 page technical document and the model will still keep track of what's going on. That alone makes it extremely useful for dev tools, rag pipelines, agents, or anything where long memory matters. You're not chunking context anymore. You're feeding it everything. Now let's talk dev perspective. Quinn 3 supports all the usual suspects. Transformers, Hugging Face, VLLM, Llama.cpp, you can run it in the cloud or spin it up locally on a GPU box. Because it's Apache 2.0, you can fine tune it, deploy it, even embed it in closed source apps. No legal headaches. And here's where it gets really cool. In code benchmarks, Quinn's three big MOE model beats or matches some of the best proprietary models out there. It's solving code forces problems. It's reasoning through functions. It's not just parroting syntax, it's actually understanding what you're doing. And then on top of that, if you're building in multiple languages, like we said before, Quinn 3 was trained from the ground up to support global use. Not just English or Mandarin, but a wide swath of languages that make it uniquely useful for international apps or even multi-market agents. All of this for free. That's the part that I keep coming back to. Quinn 3 isn't just a good model, it's open powerful and flexible. 
It gives developers the one thing we rarely get with AI tooling, control. You control the weights, you control the reasoning, you control the deployment. It's hard not to see Quinn 3 as a signal, a shot across the bow of a closed model ecosystem. If companies like Alibaba are putting out models this good, this open, it forces the entire industry to think differently. And if you're building anything that touches AI, agents, co-pilots, apps, internal tools, you'd be smart to at least give Quinn 3 a spin. I'm Zach, this is Patch Notes, and that was Quinn 3. Catch you in the next one.